my name is Grace and welcome to Get to a Family. So today I'm going to show you how to use a programming language for kids called Scratch. So what you have to first do is that you search on Google Scratch and then you press the fi uh, first one called Scratch Imagine Program and Share. So you press on it. So then it'll come a different page called scratch.mit.edu. So what you have to do is join Scratch. Or you can do your programming without, without joining. So I prefer to join. Because I like to share my projects and save my projects. So first, let's join Scratch. So now you have to do your username and your password and type for password again. So then we do next and then which country you live in. I live in the United States in America. And then next, when renewable, you have to do the month and the year. And then do the next. And then if you're female or male, if I'm a female, so I'll choose a female, my email. And then it'll say, welcome to Scratch Niche Tips. And then you do get started. So now we have this one. And then it's saying, conform your email to enable sharing. So then you do that. So first you have to do create. Press create. So this is, this is called the, the blocks or commands. So and then this is where you write the programs and th th this is called the stage where things will appear. So and then you can choose a sprite. A sprite means a character. So you can choose anything you want. You can choose a duck, earth, glass water. I will be choosing Abby. So let's remove the cat. Go to the cat sprite and you just press that button. And then it will get deleted. So now we just have Abby there. Now let's choose the background. So I will do the... I will do hayfield. So then the background will be the hayfield. So now what we're going to do is... We are going to... We're going to go to the costume and then you can see her different moves. So we are going to pick, so that, that means she's mad. But we're going to pick her, 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 her smiling one. So then you're going to do the events when green flag clicked. Then go to looks and switch costume to Abby C. Because the, that is the C one. So now we are going to do switch backdrop to Hayfield. And then we're going to do, we're going to do, go to X minus 28. Now we're going to go to looks and do switch costume to ABA. ABA. Then do say hello for two seconds. My name is Abby. For two seconds. But if for two seconds, it's good. So now, when we press the green flag, it will say, hello, my name is Abby. So and then we're going to glide one second. And then, you see, but we want it to move super, super far. So we will have to put 250. Now let's do switch backdrop to, to tree. So we have to pick the tree. And then do the switch back up to tree. So and then we're going to do hi, my name is hi, my name is Abby. So now do go to x minus twenty eight and y minus fifty seven. So now then when she moved, it is in the tree. Tree backdrop. Now we're gonna pick another character. Let's go to the costume tab and we're gonna pick this. So now let's change her color. I'm, I'm going to put red for her shirt. 
Now let's do the to there, and then when we want to face her the other way, go to the classroom and do flip horizontal. So then, now let's go back to the coding and do looks and say hello, mom, for Abby. So and then go to the character and then say, then for her we will say events when green flag clicked. Then we'll go to the looks and do hide. When backdrop switches to tree, uh, show with saying say hello for two seconds. Hello, Abby. I was waiting for you. They both speak at the same time. So let's go ahead and await a block. And you go to the do the wait one three seconds in the control. Hello, my name's Abby. Hello, Mom. Hello, Abby. I was waiting for you. So that is how. Now you go to the file and save now. And then you go. So that is how you create a program. So now let's go to the tutorials. And there's lots of programs in the tutorials. Next, I'm going to show you how to do a video motion sensing game. So let's get started. There's a button in the bottom extension. So you click on it and you get the video sensing. So and then you'll see your face on the screen. So before you delete the cat and then you'll see your face fully complete. And then you will have to choose a sprite and you go to the blue. So you put the balloon like on your hand size. So then you go to when video motion 10. And then you will have to go to sound and play sound pop until done. Or you can just record it. How you record it is and you just press record but we want pop. So you, so you choose pop and then you will have to go to looks and you choose change color effect by 25. So let's go to motion and then you get the one that says go to random position. So when you try to hit the balloon, when you try to hit the balloon, it goes away. So it continues 